YouTube, what's cracking? What's going on, G? I am back with another video. Please get this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Hey, bro, it is hot as shit today. Today is hot. Anyway, we're not talking about that. We're saying we got a better video for y'all today. I want y'all to watch this video, and then we finna talk about it. If you are new to the channel, please give this video a thumbs up. If you are, if you never been on my channel before, if you never watched my video, please consider subscribing, all right? Um, man, let's get to the video, G. Let's go. A nice guy did finish last a lot of times, but I've been both guys. I've been the yeah. nice guy, and Me it too. didn't work. And I, I stopped the bad boy, and it didn't work. Right. But of the two, the bad boy always works a little more. Uh, so I I mean, I mean, I mean, are women attracted to toxicity? Young women. Young women. Young women. Oh, because you grab a chicken, what smells familiar? Cap. Cap. Cap, 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 cap. Cap. I've dated both. I've dated older women and younger women. Let's keep going. If you come from a household where machismo and all that is around you, you unconsciously feel safe in that. Yeah. And that's but what then you, you learn from peers, too, because you watch your boys go, man, he's, he's hit. Man, he's an ass. <laughs> so I think I'm going to do that because high school happened to me. I was the nice guy. Man, I was like, get us flowers. My mother's like, that's good. I did all that. And I got I got doodled on. And I was like, that will never happen to me again. I just, oh, man, we got to attack this I think that's happening to all of us. That might be the that. origin story of our time. Yeah, yeah. 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 I was the, I was the poem writing. Yeah. 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 To me or not to me. And then when I saw her go for the bad boy, right. Yeah. Right. I was like, fuck these flowers. Yeah. Yeah. And it worked, right? And I was like, I will never be heartbroken again. I never want to feel that. And it hurts. And you know, man, we can't take that. I'm glad we. I thank you for that because I think we just get going from that a little bit. Facts, facts, facts. Listen, I've been, bro. I've been the nice guy. I've been the nice guy. It never. Ever, ever work out for me, ever. And also, there's a, there's a, there's something that that's been said when you ask the women, right? And they say, oh, it's the younger women that are toxic. So you mean to tell me, good guys had to wait for her to have a few kids? So she's not younger anymore. See what I'm saying? Then she'll be mature enough, huh? So we gotta wait for you to be to get ran through by all the guys. We 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 need to wait for you to be old as f. We need to wait for you to to be effed up mentally, physically, emotionally. So now you're not young anymore. Now you're old. So now nah, we need to go for you? Nah. Nah. We're not doing that. <laughs> we're, not we, we're not finna do that. I I seen guys that brings flowers on the first date that get rejected. I was the type of guy that would take women out to eat. First date, because they say, well, you know what? Date. She's an angel. My mom will tell you, oh, not true. Women will respect. Treat her like a queen. It never worked out for me. Every dude that turned out to be that type of dude, that's because they've been through the heartbreaks. And I'm going to tell you right now, the more of a bad boy that you are, it works out for you. I would go somewhere and you know, I would be the type of guy that you know, well, that I think that they would want to see. And that type of guy that I think that they would want to see, they'll shit on that type of guy. And I'm talking about working with women. 
the type of guy that you think they want to see. So I immediately switched up. And I'm going to tell you, even, bro, even in the workplace, bro, even in the workplace, you'll realize that the guy that's, man, man, fuck all that talk, nigga. What? Man, who, who, she's saying? Bro, this, this, I'm not saying to be disrespectful, but the type of guy with that demeanor, you see, the, that type of guy is the guy that gets what he wants. Facts! That type of guy is the guy that get what he wants. When you too proper, I'm telling you right now, when you too proper, when you go by the rules, it never works out for you. Just like with the government. Just like with the government. What they say? Oh, pay bills, pay taxes, pay the wood. So we found loopholes around the taxes shit. We found loopholes around, you see what I'm saying? Because even when you're paying taxes, the government is still f over. Because you get taxes on a money that's you already, that, that's been taxed. The money that they pay you, your paycheck, it's been taxed. And so with that money, you still gotta pay taxes on shit that you already bought. So you get taxed double time. So what people do? They open the LLCs. They do all type of, you know, you know, some people say, woo, you know, that y'all, yeah, man. I ain't even going to, uh, you know, uh, dig too deep into that because, you know. But I'm saying, like, it's the same thing for women, bro. I've seen husbands that give women the world. And she leave that man for a, 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 for a dude that, that could make her smile a lot more and laugh. And, you know, you know how they say, you know, if you could, if you could make her giggle, you can make that ass jiggle. And it is facts. It is it is a factual, you know, saying. I've seen it. I've heard it. The nicest guys, they never, ever, ever. I'm just being honest. I'm telling you right now. I've been, I've been, I've been through that. I see exactly what it is. When it comes to relationship, when it comes to marriage, you have to still implement that bad boy, uh, you know, energy. Because I'm even even with even with marriage, she still gets tired. I know somebody personally that told me, "Oh my God, he had to court me," and then that same person say. I wish sometimes I was single. No, 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 bro, bro. He had to court me. He, <laughs> he had to work to court me. But it should say, I wish sometimes I was single. Why? Because he a good guy. I want to experience a little more. I want to experience the bad boy even when they are older. You're intriguing, bro. When you're the bad boy, you got the nice car, you know, you don't give a fuck what they think. You don't care what they think, G. You gotta play the game. You gotta sell them a dream. And this is what I this this what I've been doing. And it has worked for me. It has worked for me. Being the nice guy, bring her flowers, care about her fucking feelings. It does not women women going to come down in the comments and Lie to y'all. So they finna come down in the comments and lie. But I promise you, look at all of the failed marriages, right? But a lot of them, when they say, "Oh, women are women uh, uh, initiate the divorce and things like this," let's 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 out of all the men that's that's abusing women and all that, seems that let's 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 focus on the ones that actually care for the woman and these women cheat on them and well she feel guilty so guess therefore she goes and you know initiate the you know the divorce because she feels guilty. Why? Because these men were nice. Because these men were good men. Because these men, you know, realize that, well, you know what? This is what the Bible say. I'm going to do what the Bible say. I'm going to do what the church say. Oh, give her everything she ever wanted. It never works out. A 
I'm just being honest. If you if you if you're the good guy, bro, you give her everything. I can almost guarantee. I can almost guarantee. You're too predictable. And she going to, bro. She going to find somebody that's not that's unpredictable. One, bro. Even if she, even if she don't cheat on you, she's imagining. She, she might go out and see a guy that's. Oh yeah, what's happening? And and, and, and then her coach is just wet. But she, she, she's just, she's just looking at him, and that's how she feels. She hasn't cheated on you yet, but she's imagining. Yeah, she, she's imagining, and she wished that you weren't here. I seen it happen all the time. Women tell me all the time that's what they do, so I know the game, fellas. I'm gonna be honest with you. The best advice I could give you as a man. Work on yourself, get to your bag, and of course, stroke them out and get like, do what you got to do. But don't ever be the nice guy to, to stop doing what you're doing for a woman. Quit your job and, and go help a woman. Be the nicest guy ever. Bring her everything, give her everything she needs. Don't ever do that. You better able to say no to her. Don't always say yes to her. If you do not agree with something, you say no. I'm going to say it again. If you do not agree with something, you say no. Because if you keep saying yes, yes, every, everything, yes, 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 you're going to be the one that's going to get cheated on. I promise you that. That's the video for today, G. Please give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Uh, until next time, I'm out of here, G.